Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. This week it's all about the pre-workout makeup look. And I know what you're thinking, crazy, you've been told your whole life not to wear makeup to the gym. Well, uh, I like doing it. Plus, when you're using good ingredients, it really doesn't matter at this point. And you know what, it helps you look good before, during, and after a workout. So, pretty much, I woke up with a zip this morning, which is ugh, frustrating and rare, but um, it happens. So I'm going to go ahead and use the um, FOMO. It's actually Lush's new line of face cleansers. And pretty, or fit, not, it's not even a face cleanser, it's a face mask. And pretty much it is a jelly. It's really fun. And you mix it in and it kind of has the texture of a lotion that won't go into the skin. Um, so it feels, pretty much stays this foamy kind of, it's not even foamy, it's creamy. Creamy looking and you leave it on for 10 minutes and when you take it off, man, is your skin so soft. And then, of course, you guys know I am a devoted fan of Josie. Um, so I'm going to use the Josie Moran Argon Oil, and it has the Illuminizer. It's brand new. It's her Moon Drops. And then the number seven, um, Protect and per Perfect and Protect. Protect and Perfect. One of those. Um, the eye cream. And this is perfect for everyday use. I use it night and day. Um, night, I'll add a little bit more, but for the daytime, before my workout, it's perfect. Now, as you can see, this is the Josie Moran um, Moon Drops. And they go gorgeous on any skin tone and they um, just make everything just nice and soft um, and this is the RMS Beauty I'm actually really new to this brand but it is an organic beauty and this is called the uncover up um, it mine is in number 11 and I go ahead and dig my nail into it and I just only do a little bit and you guys I don't know if you guys saw my earlier video foundation for freckles if not go check that out um, and then I use the naked skin urban decay and like I said in my last video, you as freckles don't want to put it in a triangle underneath your eyes as that covers up your freckles and we don't want to do that. So just kind of gently go along where the under eye circles are and I have, you know, they're deep today because I stayed up late last night and you know, everything, every, every day is due. Every day is new. <laughs> Um, so then this is the hourglass and I honestly if you don't want to put on color before the gym Don't even worry about it. This was just for the video um, This one's all natural and it's just a coconut balm pretty much with um, I think there's a few essential oils in there, but I love the little pot. It's adorable um, So yeah, I'll go ahead and put that on um, swap it out for just chapstick if you'd like or a lip balm or something a little bit heavier um, comb the eyebrows up. I always struggle with doing this, but it is amazing what it does to your face when you comb your eyebrows up. And yes, because my eyebrows are thick, I do have to pluck the unibrow a lot, but that's okay. What we do for beauty. And then I actually didn't show the arm, um, illuminizer that I put on, but it also is Josie Moran. And I just put it on pretty much everywhere to give me that dewy look. It is a dry illuminizer, so it's, um... Just kind of so it balances out the oil to dry ratio, I guess. And then this is the Perk It Up. This is a lip, lip and cheek tint from um, Super Goop. And this isn't natural either, but I just love the feeling of it. And then I go ahead and powder and just to kind of control, like I said, the oil to dry ratio. And that's honestly it. I work out in this. It looks good afterwards. And thanks for watching, guys. Mwah!